How are you? I hope you are fine by the grace of God. Good. We have come to, we are coming to the end of the trimester. Okay. Uh, we looked at probabilities. We looked at probabilities. We realized there are two types of probabilities. We had the theoretical probability and experimental probability. Yes. Which you realize that when we talk about theoretical, it's in theory. It has not occurred. Mm -hmm. Good. Like, what is the probability of obtaining three when you toss a die? When? The word says when, which means you have not done it. Okay. You, you get the results when you do it. Then we have the experimental probability, which mostly comes from frequency table because you realize that um, an observation has been made. They went around in a class to check and they realized that 20 students like Fanta, 30 like Mott. So that is experimental. They have carried out the observation. Then based on that observation, they ask you a question to plot or find the probability. That is what we call experimental probability. Okay, good. So today we are looking at another type of theoretical probability or experimental probability. I'm saying theoretical or experimental because it is the five spinner wheel. Okay. The thing is, if the wheel was real, and we spin the wheel and we get the answer and they ask what is the probability that you have obtained three that is experimental because it has happened but if the wheel is just then they ask what is the probability that you would obtain three which means that it is theoretical because they said you would you have not done it i hope you get the difference good so let's look at the five sector wheel. It could be six sector, it could be seven sector. It depends on the question. Okay, good. Now, when they talk about sector, then what should come in mind is what? A circle. Okay, because um, an area of a circle bounded by two radii is what we call sector. So one, two, three, four, five. I have five. Okay, I have five. Then I can decide to label it two three four five six someone is saying why didn't you start from one why didn't you start from two no i could have labeled it a b c d e f g h it's very simple okay good so they could ask you a question on this that on this wheel on this five sector wheel what is the probability of obtaining a two the probability of obtaining a two Remember, I told you probability is event. Event. What is the event? They said two. So you have event over event over total outcome. Event over total outcome. So what is the event over here? Your event is two. How many tools do you have? Only one. And what is your total outcome? Your total outcome is one, two, three, four, five. Five. So then, what is the probability of obtaining a two? The probability is what? One out of five. Very simple. The probability is one out of five. Now, there are so many questions they can ask you from this. What is the probability of obtaining a number that is less than four? What is the probability of obtaining a number that is less than four? So the event, the event is still event over total outcome what is our event event is a number less than four and what are the numbers less than four two and three how many are they two so that is our event and our total outcome 
is still five. Total outcome is five. So then our probability is two out of five. Two out of five. So many questions. So many questions. What is the probability of picking a number between two and six? A number between two and six. If you say between two and six, you are talking about three, four, and five. How many are there? Three. So the probability is what? Three over five. So this is what we call the five sector spinner. Five sector spinner. It could be six, it could be seven. But remember, when they say six sector spinner, which means the total outcome is what? Six. When it says seven sector, the total outcome is what? Seven. In other words, count the number of sector. That is your total outcome. Be on Zoom Thank you very much. So we we'll have our meeting on Zoom. Make sure to be there and have a nice day. Bye.